wait to see you. Uh, when you talk about the, the world of wrestling, uh, more things are out there happening. For the longest time, it was WWE. That was the end-all, be-all, and it still is. But there are other companies out there working. When you look at those companies, is it is it kind of out of sight, out of mind? Or do the ladies uh, you know, across the street at that other place, do you look at them and go, okay, now this is just another reason I've got to uh, you know raise the bar even more? I mean, well, so I wish I could say yes. But unfortunately, I don't think they're represented um, the way that we are. They don't get as much time as we get. And they're not, frankly, they're not as good as we are. Uh, We have, and certainly on Raw, we have the best women's division in the world. In the world. And I, I say that without any hesitation in my voice. We have the best women's division in the world. And, um, and yeah, competition is great and it's great for there to be another place. And I have, um, I have, I have a very good friend of Ruby Soho over there and I would love to see her as a champion one day. I would love to see her getting the spotlight that she deserves. Um, and competition is always great, but over here we're just, we're on another level right now, man. We're on another level. Absolutely. Yeah. There are just so many damn people over there that it is, it, you know, everybody who comes on, I think. You know, there's this thought that they're going to be the next big thing, but when you just have so many people, uh, it's hard for uh, it's hard for everybody to get the shine. So I know what you're saying. Uh, so tonight, you. May-